Hi friends, so I did not make an intro to this video because I actually started cleaning at 1am because I woke up and I couldn't go back to sleep. So this is all in the middle of the night. I didn't want to make an intro at night because I just didn't think it would look good. So basically I felt the need to literally clean my whole dorm. I'm an RA and I live in the dorm so I just have this little room. I don't have to worry about cleaning a bathroom which is really nice. But basically my whole strategy today was to do things that I usually don't do that is like actually takes more time and I just really wanted to give everything a deep clean. So with all my surfaces in the room, as you can see, I dust, then I take a Clorox wipe to it, and then I take that Apple cleaner and I wipe it down further. So I really just make sure everything's clean. I've also been sick this week, so I really wanted to make sure everything was clean because I didn't want any germs all around my room. So that is basically what I'm doing in the first part of this video. I also organize my drawers and clean them out, like take everything out, wipe them down, and then put everything back and organize it. So it was actually really productive and a really deep clean. But also I washed everything. I washed all my dishes. I had a bunch of dishes piled up and I washed like the little things like stuff in my Keurig and stuff in my microwave, like all that kind of stuff. So I really made sure I had a deep clean of everything that doesn't usually get washed because sometimes I forget because I am in a dorm so it's easy to forget that you need to clean things in your dorm. So I got a scrub mommy. I've never used like a scrub daddy sponge before so I really liked it. I am going to keep buying them because I really like the way they work. So that's what I used. I was really excited to use something new to try that with. Um, I also washed out my Keurig. I wash it with vinegar. So basically, I read this thing online that's if you use part water, part distilled vinegar, it'll clean the inside of your Keurig. So don't yell at me if I did it wrong with the measurements. I kind of just guessed. And then I ran a bunch of water through it after. But that is how I cleaned that. I definitely don't do that very often. So that was a deep clean. I also take lens wipes and clean off my electronics. I clean off my hairbrush. I vacuum. I mop. I did laundry even though the dryers don't work. I wash my sheets, my comforter, everything. So I just wanted to say everything I was doing in the beginning of this video. That way I can just play music and you guys can just like enjoy the satisfyingness of this video. I didn't want to talk through the whole thing because that's a lot. But I hope you guys enjoy this video and I will let you guys watch and put little comments if I feel like there needs to be but thank you guys so much for clicking on this video i definitely needed this for my room because it was really dirty so i hope this motivates you and you clean your living space and that's pretty much all i have to say so enjoy the video
I do also want to say that I've never had a Swiffer wet jet before. Oh my gosh, my dog just like almost puked. But I thought that you were supposed to peel the little strips off, but really you're just supposed to put your mop down on it so it grabs it. So I literally destroyed this first one, but I just wanted to say that. <laughs> My clothes are so wet. I'm so mad. Ugh. camera's about to die but that is it for this video it was very stressful but very satisfying and productive so i hope you guys enjoyed this probably took me like five hours if you count the laundry situation which all this stuff is wet and i have to like do more for it because the dryers don't work i'm a little stressed but i feel better that it's all done and now i'm going to study for my exam that's this week so thank you guys so much for watching i hope it was satisfying let me know if you guys want any more cleaning videos or what kind of videos you want and i'll see you guys in the next video